fuck I love fishing. So we're out here this morning on Barao Waters. We're going to be targeting Mulloway on soft plastics. Uh, look, it's uh, low tide. Um, tide's just about to change. We're going to go and try a few different areas, move around a bit and see if we can't, uh, can't find a couple. But uh, anyway, stay tuned for more. G'day. So I'm going to take you through what we're using today to target Mulloway. Uh, basically, it's a pretty simple setup. I have a two to four kilo rod, a 4,000 size reel, using 10 pound braid today, and a 10 pound leader. Now the guys down at Windsor Bait and Tackle have given me uh, some of these Lunker City uh, swim fish to try out. I don't know, they're probably about maybe 90 mil, 80 mil. Uh, and it's a nice natural color there. So look, I think they're gonna work really well. So we'll have a bit of a flick around this morning and uh, see if we can't find ourselves a Mulloway. So where we are at the moment, I'm sitting in about eight and a half meters of water. Uh, maybe 10 meters in front of us out here uh, is only about two meters of water and it drops off quite quickly. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get our lure, we're gonna cast it over into the shallow water and we're gonna work it off that drop off. Look, the Mulloway usually sit along where there's a drop off, wait for any little bait fish to swim swim off into the deeper water and that's, that's when they get them. They are an ambush predator. So uh, we'll cast this one out there and we'll see if we can't find ourselves a you know, at Mulloway, even if it's only a schoolie. Still good fun on light gear. So just cast it out there, let it sink down. Now it's only shallow over there, so it won't take too long to sink to the bottom. Now the movement's just a nice easy lift and let it lower back down to the bottom. Going to repeat that process all the way back to the boat. size to it and some head shakes. We nearly got it to the surface. Uh, we'll get it on board and have a bit of a look, see what it is. I don't need the net for this one. Oh yeah, it's a dewy. There we go, a little bit of uh, persistence finally pays off. It's not a big one, but dewy's still a dewy. We'll get it on the My, uh, probably only my second time out really targeting them on soft plastics, uh, recently anyway. I whipped him right in the corner of the jaw. Uh, only fishing pretty light, 10 pound today. Let me see if we can get this hook out. Give you guys a look. So there we go, chewy on soft plastics. Uh, in the Hawkesbury River, down in Barao waters. Uh, tide's just changed, the slow tide just started to run back in and just hooked him right in the corner of the mouth. So uh, not a bad sized fish, probably about 65 centimetres, maybe only 60. We'll get him back in the water and see if we can't get a couple of more bigger ones. about that actually.